Hey, Jim. Good to see you, man. What's the trouble? Take a guess, bro. Might have something to do with those cops that pulled one over on us. I figured. The way I see it, we got two choices. Either we buy a big tub of grease and prepare to take it from these fat pigs the rest of our lives. Or? Or we head over to the clubhouse. Close to where I happen to know they got themselves set up, and we show them that we're not quite the bitches that they think we are. Well, well, tempted as I am by your first option, I'm gonna have to go with the second. I figured you'd say that. Lead on, James. I like the feel of a fully automatic pistol in your hand, you son of a bitch. How about we race over to those fucking dirty cops, old man? Think you can handle it? Something on your back, Johnny. How do I look from behind, man? You like looking in my patch? Wait here a minute. Hey, officers, how you doing? Hey, McCornish, this fat purpose brought us a present. <laughs> no, I forgot how stupid looking this guy was, Matthews. Like, you think he's smart enough to realize that we got expensive tastes? What do you uh, got for us, Mo? Oh, exactly what you asked for. Well, all right. Oh, oh, hey! Uh, there you go! <laughs> Come on, man. Make tracks to Trinity Road, John. You stole his donuts, spilled his coffee. Real mature, man. We don't want to piss him off too much. Not yet, at least. Balls the size of mangoes. You know what? I can't wait to get him down to the precinct so we can really stomp on those fuckers. I'm gonna throw him in a holding and let a pack of meatheads break them fucking potatoes for us.
my, my man Johnny. Shut up and get ready to lose. Hey, Butterface, I hope you got a nice personality.